So I'm feeling a lot better now. I'm finally over my cold. So I decided I would do this review for you all, finally. Ah, oh, I've read this book like a week ago, so bear with me. This review might be a little, you know, unpracticed. And the book I'm going to be reviewing today is Bait by Alex Sanchez. I've been really wanting to read a book by Alex Sanchez for a long, long, long time since uh, Melissa basically um, recommended The God Box by him. And I could not find The God Box at Barnes & Noble, so I decided to pick this one up, which actually sounded really, really good. It's basically about this boy named Diego, and Diego is living with his mom in a city. I can't remember the city's name, I'm sorry. But he's living with his mother and his brother, little brother. And so Diego basically um, gets put on probation for hitting someone because that person had looked at him funny. And because of that, um, Diego punched him in the face and was put on probation. So right off the bat, you can kind of tell that Diego is sort of a homophobe, which at first made me kind of hate him at first, like, cause I hate I hate homophobes. If you don't know, I hate them. And, you know, he could have just, you know, talked to the guy and said, hey, I'm not gay, and, you know, let it go at that, but he actually hit him, so that kind of frustrated me. So he gets put on probation, and then he meets his probation officer, Mr. Vetus, and Vetus is a, obviously, I said probation officer, and basically he becomes sort of his therapist in a way. Because Diego is dealing with a lot of things, he's dealing with this deep, dark secret, and also he resorts to cutting himself. So it's really, really, really dark, and it's it's very, very sad, and it kind of makes you think, like, about how people are. Because when you think of bullies, you kind of, you know, I, I, I've been bullied before, so I kind of know how it, go, how it works. But when you think about it, Bullies, you know, they, they, they have something going on. They have something that makes them become, make them um, act out. And it's, it, you've got to kind of think like that when you get bullied. I mean, you, obviously, while you're being bullied, it's really, really hard. It was hard for me. And so you kind of have to think of it on both sides. That's basically what I got out of this book. Um, it's a very, very good book. It has a very good message. And I just, I could honestly really relate to the message behind this book, and I won't say why because it's kind of personal, but it just, it, it was really, really, really good. And I really liked Mr. Vitas. He was awesome. Um, I really liked how he was a really good role model for Diego. He was, oh, so, so good. I loved him so much. And yeah, the only thing that I did not like in this book, which I would have liked more of, actually, is the description of the characters were kind of vague, I guess. And also, I would have liked more character development in this book. I mean, obviously it's about Diego, but the side characters kind of had little to no development in some ways. Like, the important ones did, but I would have liked a little bit more. Just a little bit. But maybe that's just me. I just would have liked that a little bit more. But it was still a really, really good book. And I definitely recommend it. I will, however, say that this does have very mature content, and it is very dark, so... I would not recommend this for younger teens, probably ages 14 and up, maybe. You know, you know, decide for yourself, I guess. But I, I, just, just so you know, there is dark material, so keep that in mind. And yeah, I can't wait to read more Alex Sanchez books in the future. It's awesome. So the book I'm currently reading right now is Glimpse by Carol Lynch Williams, and I'm liking it so far. I'm already that far in, so I'm almost halfway through it, and it's really good so far. Um, thank you, Karen, for recommending this book. It is so good. I'm liking it a lot. So expect a review of this soon. So I hope you all enjoyed this review, and I will see you guys next time.